New details now. A lawsuit has been filed against a woman charged in connection with a golf cart crash that killed a bride and severely injured the groom. This happened last month on Folly Beach, and according to SLED, Jamie Komorowski had a blood alco alcohol concentration of 0.26%. That's more than three times the legal limit. That's what it was at the time of the crash. Eric Hutchinson and Samantha Miller had just left their wedding reception when police say Komorowski slammed into the back of their golf cart. Miller died at the scene, and Hutchinson and several others on the golf cart were hurt. The lawsuit alleges that hours before the incident, Komorowski was served at several bars despite her being visibly intoxicated from videos and pictures. Attorneys are now calling on those establishments to cooperate with their investigation. I would think that given the tragic nature of this case that, that they would want to own up to um, whatever happened or didn't happen for that matter. And so we've seen cooperation from some, like I said, from some parties. Um, others are, are tightening up a little bit. Um, some of the questions that we still would like answered are um, what was the sequence of events, for example. We have a good idea, but we need them to help us firm that up. The establishments that allegedly served Komorowski alcohol and at least 20 unnamed people are also in the lawsuit. You can read our full story right now on WIFF4.com.